Hello everyone, welcome to Arrow Cody. Please show support to this broadcast. Please, by all means, share it with your friends, your family, and show some support and dedication and work that you put in every day in every blocks of life so you can form and mold yourself and better yourself as a spiritual being and better yourself as a mental and physical fitness awareness person as well as a spiritual leadership and become a better you. This channel is based on spirituality, it's based on uh, virtual reality understanding, and based on um, collecting your thoughts and simply thinking of your future ahead of time. And I hope y'all enjoy this stream, hope y'all enjoy this broadcast, share it with your friends, your family, and give a little bit of donation here and there. Arrow Cody, welcome to the show. Hello, welcome to Arrow Cody. Today we are going to talk about a, a situation where the news was blaming the Mexico border as well as the Chinese border, saying that they brought a lot of other diseases into the continent of our country. So they're basically well known to come up with different varieties for different medicines for this coronavirus 19 shit. But honestly, to be honest, it's not Mexico or China that you should be putting the blame on. <clears throat> it's your own government officials and your own variety of um, commitment of dedication. You don't put effort to make your country better. Basically, America, it's easy to put the blame on some other countries when... You're at fault, and you're the reason why a lot of shit goes down, and you're the reason why a lot of crap happens to other countries, and you're the reason why a lot of innocent people and kids get abused, neglected, abandoned, and uh, and so much shit. You're the reason why there's sex trafficking and shit. You're the reason why there's drug cartels. You're the reason why there's a lot of gang activity. America, you have no right to talk down about any other country. You need to look at yourself. You need to react to your own self-environment awareness and realize that not everyone hates you and not everyone is the fall of your idiotic ignorance that you created and developed in your own way. Basically, you need to sit here and realize that not all countries are bad not all governments from other countries are bad I know some people that's lived in other countries that says 10 times better than America not lying I have no sugar coat and nothing and I don't have a reason to lie America you need to look at yourself this was not even your homeland you bullied the Indians out of their land this was the Puerto Ricans, the Mexicans, and the Indians' homeland before it was yours. Now you need to look at yourself. You need to reflect off yourself and realize what you're saying is wrong. Or you're going to end up in a war of chaos and mayhem that you're going to have and a lot of shit you ain't going to be able to deal with. Now, you're going to have a lot of people on your continent, on your country, on your culture... And they're going to sit here and turn against you when you need them the most. When you need a cure. When you need help. When you need support. When you need dependence on other countries to help you. They're not going to be there to help you because you talked down to them. You disgraded them. Discarded them. As they're the problems why a lot of this crap is happening. They are not the problem. You are. You're lazy. You depend on other countries. You don't do shit for yourself. You don't do shit to believe in yourself, to better yourself. Physically, mentally, and emotionally, you are a traumatically, systemically a proven wreck to this environment of sentimental, ethic, spiritual way of life. You have no right to talk about no one else. 
you are a complete wreck. You have no right to talk down to other countries when they've been there giving you the stuff that comes from other countries, all the things that we read on the back of our computers, phones, everything comes from China, everything comes from Russia, everything comes from Taiwan, everything comes from Iran, everything comes from them. Without them, you will not have future technology. You have no right to talk down about any other country or any other culture differences of beliefs. You are the fault. You are the reason for your own mischief and mayhem that's happening to you. You're the reason for a lot of chaotic shit. I don't mean to spit back at you in a full blown attack, but seriously, America, grow the fuck up, mature, and realize that you're the problem. You're the reason for a lot of chaos, sex trafficking, abuse, neglect, people getting. Trademarks and tattoos on them to be traded in for other races. You are a very abusive country. You have no right to talk down to any other country. That's all I got to say about that. So basically, now that that's said and done and dead, I wanted to put that out there so y'all know who the true fall, who the true fault is. America, you're the reason for a lot of shit that goes down every day. You're the reason. You're greedy. You force beliefs on other people, and you tragically try to change people's opinion because you care what others think. Basically, you're the troublemaker. You have no right to talk down to Africans. You have no right to talk down to Chinese. You have no right to talk down to Russia. You have no right to talk down to Iran. You have no right to talk down to Taiwan. You have no right to talk down to any culture differences or culture asides of different cinematically ethics of this world besides yourself. This was the Indians, the Mexicans, and the Puerto Ricans' homeland before it was yours. You never had control. You never had. A systematic balance in your neighborhood. You never had control of anything. This country doesn't belong to the white men. This country don't belong to the black men or women. This country belongs to the Indians, Mexicans, and Puerto Ricans that were here before you, and this was their homeland, and you bullied them out of it because they didn't want to believe the same shit you believe in. They believe in something different, and you try to force beliefs and control them by putting in a bunch of what do you call that? A、uh, bunch of crap about Christianity and stuff like that. That's what divides us. That crap right there needs to go off the map. I'm sorry, but I'm tired of people dissing other countries because they want to put the blame on other countries instead of looking and reflecting back on themselves. To realize that they, for once they may actually be wrong for once, and they are the problem, and accept defeat, and accept that you are the reason for a lot of shit that goes down. America, white men, black men, doesn't matter. All you fools out there should realize America was never great, and this proves it. Right here proves it. This coronavirus nineteen proves how ungreat this country is. And y'all need to wake up and realize you have no right to talk down to any other country. Indians and the Puerto Ricans and Mexicans were here before you, and you have no right to talk down to any other country. You are the problem. Fix yourself. Don't try to fix somebody else until you learn your self environment of awareness of your own attitude and fix your own goddamn self. You have no right to judge a mental anyone. Thank you. Hope y'all enjoyed this broadcast. Stay safe and enjoy your life. And please don't be so jump up in middle and uptight and try to knock other countries down when you're the problem for a lot of mayhem. Thank you. Have a nice day.